He was chased into his own store and shot at. A man targeted for his Rolex watch is the latest in a string of violence in the Melrose Shopping District. Good evening on this Friday. I'm Chuck Henry. I'm Kathy Barra. Colleen has a night off. We're also streaming right now on Roku, Fire TV, and Apple TV. NBC4's Darsha Phillips has reaction now from an employee who is actually inside when this happens. Uh, it was one right here. Um, it was another right here. Anquan Hayden points out the bullet holes in his brother's store, Gentry Garb, in the Melrose District. You hear two loud, real noises, like, you know, bow, bow, and then you hear, like, four after that. Hayden was in the bathroom of the store on Sunday, April 10th, around 6 p.m., when two men seen here on surveillance footage ran in after Hayden's brother and started shooting. What goes to your mind? My mom, you know, she only has two kids. You know, and, um... Yeah. Mm. Police say six rounds were fired. Amazingly, Hayden and his brother were not hit. You know, my brother, you know, he came in like this, but you know, we hit in here and it was scary. No lie. It was, it was scary. Like an active shooter situation. Hayden believes the men were trying to rob his brother, who was wearing an expensive watch. The two men got away with nothing, ran back to their car, and left. Police tracked down and arrested 22 year old Jamario Ray, believed to be the shooter in this video, but police are still searching for his accomplice. These types of robberies are an all too familiar occurrence in this area. A few months ago, the store next door to Gentry Garb was robbed at gunpoint. LAPD says it believes a total of 17 gangs from the South Los Angeles area are involved in these crimes. For Hayden and his brother, that hits hard. I come from South Central. Like, I know what these people are going through. I really do. But Hayden says his brother and his brother's business partner built something out of nothing and hopes the people behind these robberies realize the true cost of their crimes. But at the end of the day, it's going to feel better when you attain it. Because if you just take something off, you know, that's fast money. That money don't last. Reporting from the Melrose District, I'm Darsha Phillips, NBC4 News.